Hello, Blue Tippets. We're on the Icebound Glacier. And, uh, you, you don't see any much. I just created this world. Um, I've been working on a few things. So you, you saw the, the turret in the last one. and I showed that, and I showed that, and that. But I didn't show this. Because I, I, I made this today. And then, uh, so, so I made a, a gun and push the button and it, it shoots. And you can turn it. And you can, you know, I, I, words thing, yes, works, yes. Um, yeah. So that's, that's basically all it is. Uh, you could change the engine speed, which would be this one right here. So I can lower it. So now when I push the button, slowly, and then I could just be like, let's shoot a little faster, a little faster. Even faster. And if you go any faster than that, it doesn't really. Yeah. Yeah. So that that is thing. Um, we'll just do it, turn it off like that. Um. So I made that. Uh, I also made this hover thing, which doesn't really have anything to do with the update. Um. But what I did is, you know, hovercraft's uh, sides are supposed to be, you know, collapsible. So I decided to put them on springs, right? So the middle one is on a spring there, and it's, or sorry, suspension there, suspension there. And then the bottom ring is on a suspension there and a suspension there. So it actually allows it to compress quite a bit. Um, so if, if I drop it, you'll see all of it compresses. And it's got hovers in there, uh, two sets per side, uh, one for the main thrust and the other one just to keep it, you know, even more level so it doesn't all compress all the way. And then you have the thrusters on the back for steering, which are on a swivel, no glitches, just, you know, yeah. And it, it glides pretty nicely. It, it's, it's meh. Uh, no reverse, no glitch steering. That, that is thing. Uh, let's see, what else was I working on? Oh yeah, I made a, a, I finished the tank. I was supposed to make it a cardboard, but I derped. Um, so you have your steering, you have your forward, you have your back. Uh, this actually does use, does use glitches. Uh, not for the steering. Well, yeah, yeah, for the steering. Um, it uses burnt batches, steering bearing. So the, you know, when you hook up your steering connection to it, it infinitely spins, and when yes, when you get out of it, it works quite a bit. Um, and then the back one here, come on. All right, so you can swivel the turret, go up and down, and then you have the standard, yeah. Yeah, that that's a thing. Uh, if you want to stop moving, you just do that, and it usually stops. Eventually. Um, let's see, another thing I built. What else did I build? Oh yeah, I built a truck. So this is a destructible truck, because I'm like, oh yeah, I should do the tank out of it, but I didn't do the tank out of it. So I decided to do a truck. I know this is a little too wide, and I really want to widen it by one, but it kind of just works, so I don't complain. Um, the entire base is completely see-through, so it's all glass. Um, the doors pop off really easily, which is nice. Uh, the hood pops off easily. Um, the rest of it's kind of invincible, unfortunately. Uh, you can shoot up the entire frame and knock everything off, and the doors, you just have to hit, like, two spots and they fly right off. Which I, I think is decent. Uh, is pretty interesting. Uh, let's see, what else do we have here? We have... Oh... Uh, okay, so that, that, that's the gun. Uh, oh, did I make? Oh, that one must be the old version of it. Oh, no. Mm, so I think I made a few other things. Because I already showed the deployable one, and I don't know why I'm spinning into my mic. That's got to be annoying for you guys. Uh, oh, yeah. So that looks 
meh, and then I painted it. So I think it looks a little better. Yeah, we'll spawn in my my first. This is the actually this is the that shouldn't lag. I put pegs on the bottom. Okay, gang, you're being uh. Yeah, I put pegs on the bottom. Shouldn't uh. Shouldn't lag. Why are you lagging all of a sudden? Apparently he doesn't like being near the truck. That was the issue. Good. I was gonna say, like, I'm pretty sure I put pegs on it to reduce lag. Uh, four. Because then we'll just spawn right there. There we go. So, yeah. Standard red, grass. A button to get in. Door closes automatically. You have your little chair to watch your TV. You got your cactus, whatever console you want there. You got your sound system. You got your bed. And you have like an alarm clock set up there. I still have to hook up everything. Um, you have your closet. And if you want to go up into the attic, you click that button. And you just come up here. There you go. Now you're into the attic. And you can, you know, you can lock it behind you, or you can just open it, and then, you know, just close it. Um, you have your washroom, um, right, you have your shit tickets, uh, mirror, uh, you know, standard, standard stuff. Your dining room table, your kitchen, I uh, still have to set up all the drawers and the stove and the dishwasher and stuff. I'll, I'll get to it. Uh, apparently I didn't put a fridge in here. I'll have to put a fridge like right there or something or maybe I'll cut out this part and put it there or maybe on the edge there. Um, yeah, as I said, just just your standard house. Um, not, not much to it. I could add like, you know, a little bit of design on the top. I'll put it on the side or the front. Um, just a little outlook part kind of thing. Um, yeah, the main reason I made this out of cardboard and glass is because I have this thing. And you can probably figure out what we're doing. Oh yeah, you can hit the switch on the door. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess the switch is kind of... Yep. Yeah, they, they shouldn't have made a straw, cardboard, or whatever kind of house this is at. Let's, let's hit the roof. This is, this is gonna lag a little bit. I hit it just perfectly, the whole thing will fall. I think if I go right there. Yeah. Pushing wrong button. That <laughs> it's just pieces flying everywhere. Oh, there goes the rest of the roof. Is it? It doesn't like it. The frame rate's just dying. Let's just stop the turret. Let's go over to the. Why is? Bad tank. Bad tank. Okay, let's go over to the truck. Yeah, I eventually want to mount this on the back of the vehicle, and that's originally what the truck was going to be for, but it didn't really, you know, the truck didn't really connect too well, so, uh, it, it's still working for this. Um, if you guys ever are interested in any of the stuff I make, uh, before I even do a video on it, I put it on friends only on Steam, so, you know, all this stuff is already on the workshop. I guess the truck isn't really reacting very much at all, this is it. Huh. See, when I did it last time, the entire vehicle just like blew up. It seems that half of it's invisible. So let's, just, let's just go over there. In the driver's seat. kind of damage you did. 
Oh, that is an okay amount of damage. It wasn't too much, so let's just... Yeah, let's just <laughs> belt it. We're gonna take off the roof. I should be able to take the passenger seat. But... Oh, there goes those doors. One wheel. Let's just go for that front frame there. That front might be a little too sensible. There you go, the front bumper. There goes the passenger seat the rest of the room. Uh, yeah, that, that. Yeah, let's see what, what the little damage is. I wonder if it's probably still drivable. Sadly. Yeah, it's still drivable. Because <laughs> that's all you need to drive the cool apparently. It's just an engine, the steering, and the driver's seat. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you don't need a windshield, the doors, passenger seat, the entire rear of the vehicle, the bumper. No, no, no. This, this is all you need. Hey. Yeah. Um, I don't know why this is continuing to try to push itself down. Let's just put that up. Okay, right, let's see the carnage on the house. Um, okay. Okay, this, this side, you know what, doesn't seem too bad, except for the roof missing. This side, got a few pot shots in it, and then it's got, you know. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, look at it. Now we don't need that attic catch. We could just... Walk right up the side of the roofing. Hey, let's try to... Yeah, yeah. No, no door anymore. It's, it's already automatic, right? Walk right in. Did I forget to, forget to paint the box? Darn it. Oh, well. This is it. It's not complete yet. Before I even publish it publicly, instead of just friends only, I'll have to flush out all this stuff anyways. Um, see if I was... I, yeah, I probably could have just slept through all this. But if, you know... Nearly escaped death, and you know, if I was yet, yeah, nope, my privacy is absolutely gone. At least you have a little escape. No, no, we can't quite fit there. Um, yeah, no, we can't really get to the attic that way anymore. Uh, kitchen seems to be pretty much untouched. The shelving is perfectly fine, the counter is perfectly fine. It's got a couple bullet holes in the side, and I still forgot to point to block there. Uh, kitchen table, if I was sitting on this side, I probably would have been fine, except for that one bullet that went straight through there. I probably would have been hit a few times. Um, yeah, if you guys want to see more scrap mechanic content, or even, you know, more content in general, give me ideas in the comments down below, or hit the like button if you want to watch more of this. Uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much what I want to show you guys. Uh, they, they fixed the glitch where if you shoot straight down, you know, that it uh, will propel you upwards. And then, you know, they fix not back. And my old vehicle, they, the turret deployer, this thing, um, it doesn't work as well as it used to now because of the stupid updates. So now if we launch it, it doesn't. Oh, no, that it landed on its feet this time. Okay, good. Uh, it's been a little inconsistent. Uh, I had to spend like. You saw how many different versions of it just to get the consistency down just so it always land like this. Um, but they modified the knockback, so uh at least it still works kind of. It's not hundred percent consistent anymore, which is a little unfortunate, but uh it still works. And you can still, you know put it back in its little area and then redeploying it, yeah, it falls right over now. It doesn't stay up. So you have to like well, that works. That's that's you know that's how a turret's supposed to work. That you know what? Flawless. I am. Why am I spitting tomorrow? My god damn it. Perfectly flawless. Right. Okay. Yep. That's that. See you guys in the next video. <laughs> God damn it, I don't even know what to say about this. This is just physics. Yes, logic, whatever. Um, yeah.